lessons in the face of adversity, my journey through the pandemic. It's hard to put into words the emotions I felt during those two long years when the world seemed to come to a standstill. The pandemic hit us all in different ways, but for me, it hit hardest when I had to face the reality that I couldn't go to college. I was filled with anticipation, eager to chase my dreams and start this new chapter of my life. But suddenly, the door was slammed shut. At first, I told myself I would be fine. I tried to stay positive. But with each passing day, the weight of my situation grew heavier. I found myself crying more often than I cared to admit. There were moments when I felt like I was stuck in a never-ending loop, watching others move forward while I remain in place, uncertain of what the future held. The isolation, the sense of loss, it all became overwhelming. But just when I felt like I couldn't carry the burden any longer, my cousin stepped in. She became my lifeline. She was the one who reminded me of the dreams I had, the passion I carried within me. On days when I couldn't see the light at the end of the tunnel, she became that light. She told me that it was okay to feel hurt, to feel lost, but that I couldn't give up. Her words and support became the turning point for me. With her encouragement, I found the strength to pick myself back up. Instead of letting those two years define me as a failure, I decided to use them as a foundation for my future success. I started making plans again, and slowly but surely, I found myself on the path toward resuming my studies. I realized that while the pandemic had taken away my sense of normalcy, it couldn't take away my determination. Today, I stand before you not as someone who gave up in the face of adversity, but someone who chose to rise above it. Yes, I cried. Yes, I struggled. But it, I didn't let that be the end of my story. I chose to rewrite it with hope and resilience at its core. Thank you.